This video illustrates a new phenotypic screening method to isolate mutants with a temperature-sensitive egress phenotype. Mutagen and parasites are applied to cultures of toxoplasma-infected human foreskin fibroblasts for two hours. The non-invading parasites are removed and the flask is transferred to 40 degrees Celsius to induce phenotype development. After 26 hours, the vacuoles contain 8 to 16 parasites. Next, cells are stimulated with egress-inducing compounds. Mutant parasites with a defect in egress will remain intracellular, whereas wild-type parasites will egress into the medium. The wild-type parasites are removed by washing, and the remaining cells are again incubated at 35 degrees Celsius to enrich the mutant population. Finally, the mutant phenotype is verified, and single-parasite clones are isolated from the enriched population by limiting dilution. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, like the biotinylation method, is that their specific enrichment of egress mutants is far more efficient. We first had the ID for this method when we identified an egress mutant from a panel of mutants with growth defects. Using that mutant, we optimize this screening procedure by mixing in various ratios with wild-type parasites. Demonstrating the procedure will be Bradley Coleman, a postdoc from my lab. This procedure uses highly mutagenic compounds and liquids, as well as the infectious parasite Toxoplasma gondii. Use of appropriate protective gear, including a lab coat, double gloves, and a biological safety cabinet is essential. Any liquid waste generated should be collected separately.